Good morning YouTube. Right, we're at Castle Cool for our track day. Cars already. I'm unloaded. Well is looking good. Um if you haven't seen the last video, I explained in that video how I've managed to get here during the Welsh lockdown because we're on a five mile travel thing me jiggy. So I'm not gonna explain all again in this video, go back and watch in the next one. Um but we are all set. Nankang AR1s are on. Uh as you saw in the last video, 15s, cheap tires. I got a full set for just over 300 quid and uh from Demon Tweaks in the sale. So pretty much all set to go um, right let's talk about my plans for today now <clears throat> I'm hoping we can set a good lap time today <clears throat> the long-term plan is and I'm not saying it's gonna happen today long-term plan is I'd love to go sub 1 minute 20 here uh, is that possible today will we do it today I'm not gonna say we are but we're gonna we're gonna beat last time to lap times. So what I've got when I was last year was 123.5. Now if you remember, I had all the intercooler issues, so the car was seven or eight mile, mile an hour down on speeds at the straight. So we can definitely improve on that. We're on better tires. So the plan originally was it was going to put ADO8R on for the morning, get a baseline time and I and go to AR1 in the afternoon. But because it's a bit sunnier than I was expecting, <clears throat> I don't want to get to the point where by the afternoon it's so hot that the tyres are overheating and we're not going to get good times on it. So I'm going straight on the AR1. We're just going to go for it and see what we can do. So, uh, so yes, all I'm going to do now is get my sound test and we're pretty much ready to go on the track. So let's get on with it. So I said first session done. What do I think there? Well, tyres, a little bit more squidgy than I expected. I don't know if that's because they are uh, 16s, a uh, fat uh, sidewall, 15, sorry. Uh, my pressures were a bit low. What are we at now? Um, we can see where we are. Uh, I started out a little too low when we was out. I put them all at 23, I think, either 22 and a half, 23. We got up to 31 on the front left. 28 or 29 here uh, we were 26 uh, here and 28 year so I've just added a touch of pressure this side they're all a little bit janky because they've cooled down now it's been about probably about half an hour since I last went out so that was my first session um, we done alright on lap time I done a 121.1 so I'm pretty pleased with that, and I suppose that's a scrubbing in lap on the tyre, so, but I feel like I've got so much to improve on my braking. I'm not confident in my braking, and it's not the car, it's just I'm nervous I'm going too close to the limit, and with the tyres. Uh, remember, I'm not running a front on roll bar, so I've got a little bit more roll on the front, and I was a little bit cautious because of the back end. Um, on tower, I had a little slide, nothing major. But it was just enough to remind me that um, the back end can move around so once it got hot it was better i've now upped the shocks i was running 15 clicks from soft in the back i've gone up to 17 and i'm running 20 clicks from soft up on the front so we're going to try that normally i'd run about 18 clicks on the front but i'm stiffening them a touch more because we've got no robot um but yeah it was good so i'm gonna get back out now and uh, see what we can do in this one Right, so as it be back in from our session, busy in the paddock. 
Dan's out that day. Dan's mini has uh, sprung a leaf from his. Oh, I can't think what they call it, CV boot. So he's working on that. It's going to look like a corner's fiesta. Do you want to be on camera, boys, or what? Yeah, go on. <laughs> so this is corner's fiesta. Like my hair. What's that? Like my hair. Yeah, don't worry about your oh, hair. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't care about hair. So, what have we got on here then? S280. So it's got S280, AirTech um, intercooler, uh, Bosch bigger injectors, uh, SD. Oh, you're on the injectors as well? I didn't know. Yeah, yeah. Um, Gaz Gold custom coilovers. Um, that's about it. Everything else is stock. The map, stock of such. course. Yeah, obviously TRS performance map. Yeah. Supplied by H Sport. Yeah. Which is our own uh, our own company. Um, so if anyone's anyone needs in the southwest any sort of um, tuning with TRS, we'll see. Here's up, no problem yeah. at all. <laughs> I'll put a link in the description. So come and see Connor and Jordan's over there, but he's camera shy. <laughs> he doesn't want to be on camera. But uh, yes, good day so far. All right, so we're going back out to see what we can do. I don't know if you can see me on the camera there. But I'm pretty chuffed we've actually done a 119. Only just scraped in 119.93. Um, and I can't say that I'm actually happy with the car yet. I made some more shock absorber changes. Stiffened up the front a little bit. Stiffened the back a touch. So we're going to give that a go. Um, and see if uh, the car feels a little bit better. It feels a little wallowy. Um, but. We can but try people, we can but try. So I've achieved my goal, 119. I, uh, deep down I wanted to do it today. I know that I said I might not do it today, but deep down I wanted to, so we go there. Uh, so let's just have fun now for the rest of the day. I would like to improve on it, I'm not gonna lie. So if we can shave it down a touch then, I'm definitely gonna try. We've got to update you, work on your car, Dan, for the viewers, haven't we? <laughs> Who's getting anyone on? Oh my goodness. So you've lost a couple of sessions, but not on all day, Dan. Yeah, thankfully. Yeah. Well, I look forward to seeing you back up, buddy. Right, everybody, as you saw, we went quicker. Let's have a get my phone out here. Um, Let's have a look what we got. I'll, uh, get out of that. Right, let's go and have a look at my laps. Uh, so we had two good runs there 119.47 and a 119.78 consecutive. So uh, happy with that. We shaved half a second off. Uh, fell a bit better with a little bit more shock on the front. I've upped the back now, so we like 23 on the back, 25 on the front. So I'm going to see how that feels, but a bit of chaff for that. I've exceeded my goal. I've gone above what I expected, so can't be disappointed with that, can we? And no problems with the car so far. Everything's going fine, so I'm going to have some dinner now, and then we'll go back out. Right, so just having a chat to this guy and his car just exploded while we were talking. It's been mad. Yeah, I need a new expansion tank. <laughs> oh wow. I'll do that, yeah. Wow. Well, that's me done. How long have you been in? Huh? How long have you been in since you've been out on track? Is it... uh, about five, ten minutes. Wow. And the fan's been on. That's crazy. It doesn't see the glue. <laughs> wow. Oh, it was hot actually. Yeah, I think I don't know if I had the fan on. I think I must have turned it off by accident. Oops. You got it on a switch, have you? Yeah. The override. Does it run Engine a pump should as be well? Right, should it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey, the week, it's the weakest point now, that's all right. Happy days. Wow. Ah. <laughs> Do you know what? I nearly bought an expansion tank the other day, but I was like, no, they're really expensive. I'm not buying one. That's incredible. 
zip ties around there, get the same one out. Zip ties, bit of grease. <laughs> You're having a laugh, are you? What else are you going to get home then? Uh, I'm going to go the AA, I think. <laughs> if they pick me up. shocks up quite high so they're quite uh, stiff so I'll uh, drop them down a little bit probably go back a click but the car was feeling good <laughs> this <year. laughs> you won't believe what I did what did you do? I was coming into the braking zone and I happened to glance down and I realised my aircon was on <laughs> My aircon was on, and I was thinking, damn, my aircon's on. And I, I had another look, mid corner, and it just took my concentration. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I went. Steve, slow down.
was epic. You must have gone 19 and yeah. filming. I don't mind it. You yeah. must have done 19, did you? 19 to 8 was the last lap. 19 to 8. So, may have even done faster than 17. 19. Yeah, holding him up, was I? <laughs> <laughs> I think I got a 19 1. I just improved on it. 19 1. Oh, we're close then, aren't we? Were you filming that? Um, yeah. Oh, um, what, awesome. Was really cool. It was going well. Did you? Did your brakes fade on the tower from getting in? Because your hazards flashed and mine, I, my brakes were like now. I left it a little bit too late to break, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Mine, mine just like now. That was great, that, that was. was good. That was good I that. was watching your car in my mirror <clears throat> and it's rotating well. Because when you're exiting the corners, you're actually in a slow drift. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the back end comes around nice enough. Yeah. Because we can turn the stiffness up a little bit, it's, you can tell it's rotating a little bit more. Um, yeah, you can see it when I was watching it. So like yeah. you can just see it's got that slight little drift on. Oh, that was good. I enjoyed that. Yeah, good. So what did you get? 119, sorry, 1928, I think. Well, that was the last half. So... Have a look at your lap list. I got a 119.08. I can't believe how close I was to... Oh, we've done both 119s. 119.28 and 119... Six one. Awesome. That was Happy good. Enough. That was a good session. I enjoyed that. One nineteen zero eight. I like that one. So cool. I want an eighteen now. They're never yeah. happy away. <laughs> You're going for eighteen now. You can't. I, I tell you what. I reckon with the right lap. I think we could both do it. Yeah. Because um, that that lap that I done a two eight on on the tower. I entered that hole. Yeah, real bad. So that that's got me. In this point you just smashed second. a second off your best time, though, didn't you? Yeah. Well, near enough. Yeah. Awesome. I enjoyed that. Just hope your camera is working. I want to see that one on YouTube. Where are you filming from at the top? Yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. I'm gonna have a cool down now and go back out. I really enjoyed that one. <coughs> right, I've just swapped the um, AR1s back radio ADAR because it's getting to the end of the day and tries I may, I can't hit an 18, so I've tried my best, but let me show you the uh, tyre wear, so this is front left, it's looking pretty good, uh, a little bit of inside wear, that's because I'm wheel spinning out the corners, so, but the other side, I've run a bit too much pressure and I'm, so, <laughs> If you look down there, see the sign of the tread line there. I think that's where they're over inflated. They went up to about 31, I think, 31 psi. Uh, quite a few times by the time the end of the session, and I just thought oh, I'll be fine. The others are about 28 ish, something like that. But the backs are fine, so I think I have learned a lesson. That one was a bit over inflated. Alright, so that's that. I'm all packed up. Look at this foam. I've got a, a four, foam wind slayer on. I've got to make sure it doesn't come into the lens. Keep the wind off the camera. Right, so yes, I'm all packed up. Ready to go on. I did think about going up and doing a session on the a 8 r I know I did say I would, but I changed my mind. Uh, I decided there's no point. I've got nothing again. I've done the best thing I'm going to do. There's no point just scrubbing the tyres for one more session. So it's 20 to 5 now. That's it. I've had a good day and to be honest with you to get a 119 uh what do we start on it 122 i think for a session which uh, obviously I, I wanted better than that deep in my heart uh and then when we broke into a, a 119.9 i was happy but to get onto a 119.08 yeah i'm chuffed with that i would love to have got an 18 though whereas before i would love to have had a 19 but when it gets so close to an 18 it's like you can't have a one more can now never satisfied see so that's the way it is I, i'll accept it still fantastic and we think we've done it on stage two power and an open diff and i have suffered because of having an open diff uh, i think not running the front handy roll bar has helped but there's no substitute for a diff so something i'm gonna have to do in future i don't think it's going to happen for a while I'll probably run this year out, maybe do it over the winter, maybe next year, see how it goes. I'm going to enjoy the car for what it is now. So, yeah, it's been a great day. Uh, it's been some great people here, some good track action. So, uh, 
I think that pretty much sums it up. I think I've covered everything. Hopefully you found it remotely interesting, maybe a tiny bit. If you have, then give it a like. But there you are. Thanks very much for watching and see you on the next video. Cheers, bye.